What is up flockers? That is my fellow lockers and aspiring lockers. In today's video, I just wanted to give y'all a quick look and update and recap of my hair from 18 months now on to 28 months. So let's look and see what that is looking like. First off, so it is a fair comparison. I feel like I need to get that same D part that I had going on in my other video. All right, so we'll go ahead and bring as much of that over as I can. We'll keep this one short and sweet. As you can see, obviously, the length is lengthening. We have way more length than we had before. Uh, so I just want to Notice the simple fact that the, the hair is hairing, the length is lengthening. In addition to the hair getting longer, just as I've mentioned in other videos where I've done updates, as your hair matures, it stops having the same issues that it was having before. So I'm not having a lot of marrying at the roots of my locks like I was in previous months and year ago and whatnot. The frizz is still frizzing, but it is less than it has been in the past. My ends are closing up a lot more than they have in the past, but I would say that I still have a good amount of curly ends. I don't do anything special to them. I just let them close as they please. I try my best not to pull the ends off when there's that little ball hanging, but I'd be lying to y'all if I said that I never do. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I'm just running my hands through my hair and I feel it and I just tug a little extra harder and it pops off. So that's that. But I try to leave them alone as much as possible just to let them do what they want to do. But yeah, for the most part, the ends are, get a little closer for y'all. The ends are still curly in a lot of places, but they are also locked in a lot of places. And my locks are forming really well. Uh, I need to put it in another rinse because as you can see, we got a lot of peekaboo locks that uh, decided that they want to be rebellious and not hold the black rinse that I put in. So I need to go ahead and get a more expensive one, one that's not just like a, a $6 box from the local store or CVS. So we'll see, we'll get a more expensive one. Like I said, so we don't have all these peekaboo ones. But what's different, we have less braid pattern. And that's something that obviously with each update video, we have less and less of, again, around the base or around the frame of my face is where I braid it the tightest. And so, yes, there is still braid pattern around the front of my head and around the, like some of them, like here, you see this one still got a ton of braid pattern. Um, but then, you know, other ones that are right next to it, the braid pattern has either completely disappeared or you can barely see it. Um, so it just honestly varies from lock to lock. Like it's, it's not even a, oh, well all these in this section are this way and then the ones in another section, like no, all over my head, my locks are maturing as they please on their own time schedule. And so I'm just allowing them to do what they wanna do I've never been bothered by the braid pattern. And even to this day, the ones that still have major braid pattern, they don't bother me. So someone who wants their locks to look like locks from the jump or within six months to a year in, braid locks might not be the way for you to go just because the braid pattern does take a longer time for it to fully disappear. But there's a lot of benefits that come with choosing braids as your starter method. So I've got videos on, on that. So if you're interested, you can check that out. But, um, yeah, like I said, we're gonna keep it short and sweet. There's not much to update in terms of how my hair is changing other than the length. So I'll give y'all a little bit of side action. Just so you can see what the hair is looking like. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the like button so I know what type of content that you are enjoying and also hit the subscribe button so that you can join the flock. And before you go anywhere, check out some of the other videos that have popped up on the screen. I'll see you there.